Hi everybody, this is Roxy, and I just wanted to show a little project. Um, I made some um, bobby pin hair flowers for my crap sale and for another crap sale coming up and for stocking stuffers. And they really turned out cute, and they're so easy to make. Um, you know, it's just using bobby pins with flat backs and any of your flower stash. Like, these are just flowers that I actually pulled out to kind of um, give away or you know get rid of and I thought you know why throw them away um, I wouldn't use them again but they're really cute for hair bobby pins and this is a tag that I made from um, it's October afternoon paper and it's from the forever young Cricut cartridge but you can make any kind of tags um, for them you, know, you can just cut little ovals from spellbinders or even just from a template that you download. So, I'll just show a couple of them that I made. So these are just little wild, or um, I am roses flowers, and then I, I stickleized everything just to give it a little spark. These I didn't. And those are just, you know, like, I think recollections with some recollection little roses. And I used the same um, shapes for the tags. Here's some fl felt flowers um, with some orange I am roses. And then these are just from the Nifty Fifties. They're a little cat and with little tiny. These are kind of cute for maybe smaller girls. But like a little tiny um, mulberry paper flower with the I am roses on top. And these are not flowers you'll see in nature, um, but they can be flowers you'll see in here. And then I, I did some dress form shapes from, I think that's from Nifty Fifties too. And then those are just two different um, glittered flowers. And some poodles, gotta have a poodle. So I will just quickly show you that it's so easy. I found these um, bobby pins, they have a little flat back. $3.99 on uh, eBay and the seller is Findings How F-I-N-D-I-N-G-S H-O-W and for 50 of these it was $3.99 and that includes shipping and they came from Japan but I got them within I mean quicker than some things you get here so I'll just hurry up and I mean it's just like super easy I actually used a uh, um, what you call it, uh, toothpick to do the glue, but I don't have one handy, so I'll just quick, and just stick your little flower on, just real simple, just make sure there's no glue on the end, you know, in between the bobby pin and that, <laughs> maybe I'll put a, a dirty napkin down. <laughs> So you can see. And then I'm just going to use some, these are from Saw Crafters, SA Crafters. Um, she sent me some of these for, um, and I've used some in other projects, but they're really fun. That butterfly would be cute, but, so, oh, that's kind of cute. Oh, I like these. This is, this will work. Oops, and then I gotta get in the bag. Okay. That's cute. And this is done. And then I would just take, where did I put my, oh, just a little bit of stickles. Just to give the little, sh everybody likes a little shiny. Catches the lady's eyes. A little bit of bling, a little glitter. Put a little bit down there. 
And there you have it. Just a quick and easy, and like I said, the the little flat back bobby pins were a steal, fifty for three ninety nine, and then just some pretty bling from SA Crafters, and you have a really pretty um, bobby pin flower, um, hair flower, and I sold a million of these little packs at my sale, and um, went and made up a bunch more because they. Really, like, especially little girls just love them. So, great little stocking stuffer if you need a last-minute gift or hostess gift. I mean, anybody can wear them. They're really pretty. I wore them at my sale and got a lot of compliments. So, thanks for watching. Bye.